Good morning and a very warm welcome to all of you here at Volkswagen CES 2017. I am thrilled to be here for a third consecutive year and I'm even happier that all of you have joined us. We have so many great new innovations to share with you that we have brought three of the big brains from Wolfsburg. Allow me to introduce Dr. Frank Welsh, Head of Development, Volkswagen Brand. Sure, sure. Dr. Volkmar Tannenberger, Head of Electrical Development. And we have Mr. Christian Zanger, Head of the E-Mobility Product Line. Thank you, gentlemen, for coming. Now, I'm going to start with Frank. Yeah. So the two of you can go get comfortable in a car. Hi there. Hi there, Amy. Now, Volkswagen has really been putting its foot to the floor the past few months. Where is this journey taking us? OK, first of all, Abby, it's great to see you again here in Las Vegas. <laughs> and as always, I think CES for me, CES stands for Progress and for Change. And that's exactly where our focus at Volkswagen is right now. Because as you know, we are right in the middle of the biggest change in our history. And in that change, it's all about innovation, of course. And we defined four, four different and exciting fields of innovation that we're going to present here at the CES. That sounds exciting. And I want to get right down to it. Tell me, what are these innovation fields? And what does it mean for our customers? OK, I mean, so. Let me start with connected community. Three years ago, we launched our own mobile online service. We called it CarNet. And CarNet is an interesting feature, an interesting app, because CarNet knows where your car is parked. CarNet knows how the weather is at your destination. And CarNet sees the current uh, traffic situation wherever you're going. And so I can say today we are very proud that today we have more than 2 million, we have 2.1 million Volkswagen cars with these online services. This online service allowing 24-7 accessibility. And here at CES, we are going to show the next steps. I love that. And I know here at CES, it's automated driving that is in all of their lips. So what is Volkswagen adding to that conversation? I think, first of all, we did a lot in terms of automated driving. For example, the new upcoming Golf yeah, it has a semi-automated uh, function in that because we have a traffic jam assistant. This traffic jam assistant will help you to stay relaxed in this boring situation of traffic jams, <laughs> as you see all day on the streets all around Las Vegas here. Of course, I think the future belongs to fully automated driving, at least as an option. And so our ID concept, this nice car over there, yeah, is prepared for that. And by the way, this ID, how we call it, has its North American debut today here at CES. That is amazing. Now, I know everyone here can understand the traffic situation you were speaking of in trying to get here today, right? As for the ID, we are going to save that for last. Right now, I want you to tell me about these amazing interactives that we have. Right over here, what is this uh, cockpit? Now this, first of all, this cockpit is great looking, but that's probably not what you mean. It's pretty cool. Yeah, but it has some pretty cool stuff in it. <laughs> but let me, first of all, you remember 2015. When we were here, we were presenting a prototype of gesture control. It was 2015, and we promised to work on that. And it was end of last year that we brought this technology, this gesture control, yeah, into production with our new Golf. And I'm very proud to add something today to announce that we will roll out this technology of gesture control to all our cars this year. Yeah. I love that. I was here in 2015, so I remember, and it's amazing that it is now coming to our cars. But what's next? OK, what's next is also built in here. Uh, one of the highlights is this digital cockpit with an innovative 3D technology. And it's a true 3D view you have in this cockpit. You don't need any special glasses, no tricks, no 2D animation, nothing. True 3D. I love it. And I had the chance to try it out myself. 
You should all try it. Uh, it's definitely pretty cool, but I know there's even more. Of course, there's a little bit more. If you look around here, we have two more interesting prototypes, and it's eye tracking, and it's a an head-up display with augmented reality. And I could uh, explain this for another 30 minutes, if you don't mind, but if not, I would do different thing, because I would like to invite everyone here, everyone to test these features, to experience these features here on the booth, because when you've done this after a while, you will know what intuitive usability will mean for Volkswagen. I agree. It's very important for all of you to interact with our displays. You'll have the opportunity to do that. This one is as if there's a 3D windshield in front of you. It's amazing. But I also like to talk to my car. Where I'm from, it's illegal for me to text and drive, so I need to be able to chat with the car like I chat with you. Yeah. And in Germany, it's illegal as well. Mm -hmm. So I'm also a friend of voice control, and that's why we made voice control available in all our cars. But as I think voice control is that important also for the future, I think it's time for a next big step in voice control. And I'm happy that Volkmar will present this to you. All right, thank so, you so much, you, Frank. Abby. I'm gonna head over here and get Volkmar out of the car. Enough relaxing for you, sir. Frank just told me that you can keep me from getting a texting and driving ticket. You have voice control? Yes, of course, indeed. And today we are showing a voice control system that is enhanced to an online recognition. This system is also able to understand natural language with our next infotainment system generation. But even more, we are enhancing the user experience by voice activation. And the best, at this year's CES, we are showing another world premiere, the first embedded integration of Alexa voice service in vehicle. And to help us with this world debut, we have another special guest. Join us, please. We have John Scumiotalis, the general manager of Amazon Alexa Automotive. Hi, Welcome. John. Hello. Good to see you. Thank you all for coming. I'm super excited to be here today and talk about the uh, Alexa integration that Volkswagen has done with their vehicles. Uh, Volkswagen and Amazon share a common vision around voice as the future. It's a safe and natural way for us to interact with the vehicle. For instance, uh, when I get home to Seattle late on Saturday night, um, it's going to be cold. I've got a long commute home, I'll be driving home, and I want to make sure my home is warm when I get there. So using hands-free voice activation, I can instruct my smart home to start the heat, get the house to a, uh, a warm temperature. And when I arrive, everything's going to be great. John, that's great how you integrated Alexa into the car. But can it also integrate my car into my home? Ab absolutely. There's, there's two sides to Alexa integration. One is using our Alexa voice services to integrate into the car, and the other is using our Alexa skills kit to build skills that allow you to access information about connected cars. So for instance, while I'm home, I could ask the car what your fuel level is. I could also send a destination to the car so that when I get in the car, it's prepared and ready for my journey. Um, I encourage you all to check out the demonstrations that we have here in the car and back in, in, on the stage here. So uh, on behalf of Amazon, thank you very much for being here. We're super excited about our collaboration with Volkswagen. John, thank you so much for joining us. It sounds like you're going to make my life easier. Round of applause Thanks, for that. Ron. So Alexa, in the car, huh? Yes, and we are going even one step further connecting different ecosystems. Oh. Volkswagen is the expert in mobility and Amazon supplies goods and entertainment services. The connection of both worlds is the next logical step. In consequence, we are connecting the automobile with the digital lifestyle with the Volkswagen ID. 
The Volkswagen ID. Tell me what that is and how it affects our customer. The user ID keeps all your personal information and settings in the Volkswagen cloud. It turns every Volkswagen into your own personal vehicle. As soon as you step in with the right music, the right seating position or the perfect temperature. For example, you can sit in a rental car and your settings will be loaded automatically. Your smartphone is the, is the key, not just for the car, but for the entire Volkswagen digital world. Here at Volkswagen Booth, you can download the VWCES app, create your own profile and interact with the prototypes, the demonstrators and of course with our connected car. Ladies and gentlemen, please feel free to try out. So you can get an impression how Volkswagen is going to network the entire mobility world with its own digital ecosystem. Thank you so much, Volkmar. That sounds cutting edge, very exciting. The next question is, what is this car going to look like? You don't have to answer. Everyone take a look up on the screens. Now that we know what the car looks like, I want to know what it can do. And so I'm here with Christian. Do you have that answer? Hello, Abby. This is ID. It's the very first car of a new Volkswagen generation. And it's a real statement for a new world of mobility. Unmistakably a Volkswagen, but yet it's completely new. The ID is built on our new modular electric drive matrix. It offers a pure electric range of up to 373 miles, an ample power of 125 kilowatts. That means pure electric long range mobility at an affordable price for everyone. That's a big deal. That's wonderful, but Volkmar and Frank just talked to me about some really cool stuff. Can I get it in there? For sure. Of course. Because ID means the whole car is resold. The ID and the new model platform will come with an amazing human machine interface and a lots of connectivity features. The intuitive operating concept will make driving easier than ever before. And for an example, the augmented reality header you just saw before will be part of the ID. Overall, you can compare this new model platform to a tablet and a smartphone. Why? Because these cars are always online, they are fully connected and for sure always up to date. Those cars will have their own identity in a digital world and they will be always easy and simple to use. I believe that. I know you German engineers and usability is always so important. I've had the opportunity to sit inside this car and Christian, I love it. It's so roomy and spacious inside. Yeah, well, the innovative driveline concept gives us way more roominess and flexibility than ever we had in the compact club. That means you get the room of a mid-sized car in the compact class. And in fact, I say this is great. But it's, that's not all. The ID is the first Volkswagen being prepared for fully automated driving. We will give people more time and greater quality of life. 
It's also a big step forward in our Vision Zero, accident-free driving. And Abby, what do you think is the most amazing of the ID? Tell me. It's not only a dream. The ID will become reality. Actually, in 2020, the ID will open a new era for Volkswagen. Fantastic. That deserves a round of applause. Thank you so much, Christian. And I want to thank all of you for joining us here. We invite you to download our app, VWCES 2017, so that you can come and interact with everything that we have. We'll have a photo opportunity here at the ID. And thank you once again for joining us at Volkswagen CES 2017.